girlfriends welcome back to my channel hi how are you girls today today I wanted to do a quick handbag collection video if you love handbag collection videos stick with me give me a like right now hit like and subscribe check out all my other handbag collection videos I have a playlist on all, some of my handbag collections and just check out my channel there's tons of handbag videos on my channel so let's go ahead let's get started today I wanted to do my jelly handbag collection now I did do my coach jelly handbag collection this time it's gonna be inclusive inclusive in other designer brands so basically I tried to pull out every jelly bag I could find <laughs> so I am missing two bags I couldn't find my Tory Burch Ella jelly bag I'll put a picture of it right here that bag is so cute it's around here somewhere but I couldn't find it for the video I'll make sure I come back and do a separate video on that handbag but we have a lot of fun bags to talk about now before we get started I do want to say that as far as material goes okay we have jelly we have the jelly handbags we know that coach is calling these the jelly handbags this is a coach jelly Morgan but there's also PVC bags that look like jelly handbags. There's rubber bags that look like jelly handbags. There's patent leather bags that look like jelly handbags. So let's just say I tried to just pull out, I, I think I'm still, oh my God, Ted Baker. Ted Baker is patent leather. Okay, I didn't bring the Ted Baker bags in here. Those are patent leather, they're not PVC, but I tried to bring out a few other bags that kind of fall under the category. Let's just get started. This is the Coach Morgan Jelly in the color yellow. Love this bag in my collection. I recently picked this bag up when I got addicted to all the Coach Jelly handbags. I love on the jelly bags. One thing that I like about them is that the, the tag is also jelly. I almost said the tag is all, also acetate. That's another, I guess, form of material or texture of material. Acetate, PVC, acrylic, um, patent leather, rubber, but the tag is also in that lovely jelly material also. So I love that about the Morgan. The Morgan line of bags, they did the Morgan, they did the Morgan shoulder bags that are a little bit, some of them are a little bit longer and more rectangular shaped than this square shape. I just love all the Morgan line of bags that Coach did. So yeah, this is my first jelly handbag in yellow. It's by Coach. It's the lovely Coach Morgan. Next, since I have it right here, is my Kirk Geiger Kensington. This is a micro Kensington, and I don't know the color for this. I don't remember. If I could find it, I'll put it somewhere here but I've had this bag for several years in my collection and I love that it's like a neon electric neon type yellow color it's even darker because I have the Kurt Geiger dust bag in there without the dust bag let me take the dust bag out so I have my Kurt Geiger dust bag in there without the dust bag it's really neon and bright you can see it right here I did a what fits on my channel for this bag so yeah it can hold a lot your keys a cell phone can fit in here lipstick a mirror just all your essentials even though it's a small bag it has a nice uh handle it has a nice strap the strap is very nice the strap is in a lovely gunmetal shade so on this yellow color this bag came in several different colors pink orange um all different colors and in this yellow color it has a beautiful smoky gray granite gunmetal smoky gray shoulder strap i love it next up since we have it right here is the coach morgan the lovely coach morgan in the color miami red i like i said i love the coach morgans <laughs> absolutely love them they're so beautiful in the jelly they look patent leather a little bit almost too but they're calling them the Coach Jelly Morgan. And this is what the hang tag for that one looks like. It's Miami red, but it looks orange. It's such a hot, I mean, sizzling hot color. <laughs> it's such a sizzling hot color, you guys. Love that Morgan in Miami red. Next up is going to be my Michael Kors bag. I have a Lululemon bag inside just to keep the shape. 
This is the Michael bag by Michael Kors. I love this bag. This bag came out, Michael Kors did it in several different colors. He did it in a beautiful yellow. He did it in a lovely rainbow pride color that has all the colors of the rainbow in it for pride. And it's, I can, you know, this bag, you see it, it's, it sometimes looks a little smoky. Well, I don't know if you girls know, but eyeglass cleaner, the same thing that I use to clean my eyeglasses, I just take a little paper towel and put a little bit of that on it. I don't go over the lettering, but I just wipe over the bag and it takes the fingerprints away. If you just use a little bit of eyeglass cleaner on it, I wouldn't use that on the Morgan or on any of the other bags, but because this bag is clear, I went ahead and I did use a little bit of eyeglass cleaner on it and it takes any smoky film away. When I purchased this Michael, the Michael bag by Michael Kors, I had forgot that I had this wristlet that matches it that goes pretty good with it. This wristlet is in a lovely tangerine mandarin color and I mean it just goes so well with my Michael bag in this lovely color. I have all the paperwork for it in the bottom right there. But this wristlet goes so well and the straps for this bag is so pretty. It's in a poppy color. The color is poppy. So the poppy and the mandarin orange looks really, really nice together. And like I said, I love using this wristlet with the bag. I had forgot I even had it when I purchased the bag. Came home, I had this and I have the matching sandals as well. I'll put a picture right here, but I have the matching sandals as well that go very well with this bag. Next up, these bags, in my opinion, they're jelly, they're patent leather, they're plastic handbags. So I figured I'd include some of them in my collection video right here. So here they are right here. You girls know the little brown bags. These are the medium brown bags by Bloomingdale's. Let me say that I only brought out these two. I have the whole collection of these. I have all the videos on my channel. I'll come back and do an entire collection video because yes, I still have all of them. The little pink bag, there's the Chicago bag, there's the New York bag. I had to have the New York bag because I was born in Brooklyn, New York. I had to have the Chicago bag. There's so many of them in all different colors, blue, yellow, pink. So I will come back and do an entire handbag video of all of these bags. But these, in my opinion, fall under the PVC plastic jelly handbag criteria. So I just figured I would bring these out and talk about them as well. They come in all different sizes. You have the little bags and then of course you have the medium sized bags. These are great work bags. The medium sized bags are great work bags. And like I said, they're from Bloomingdale's. This one has very sturdy handles. This one, I'm a little bit, you know, careful. I don't overpack this one because the handles on this one, I don't know. I've never had a problem with them, but they're a little thin. Like they feel like if you overstuff the bag and put something really heavy in it, it might pop. And I would never want that to happen. They're not very expensive bags, but still they're kind of hard to get a hold of because if you don't go into a Bloomingdale's store and purchase one, then you would have to order it online. And sometimes online they're sold out of some of the different ones that you might want and the Bloomingdale store is not always easy to get to in every city or in every state. You know, you might have to trek quite a way. You might have to drive quite a way to get to a Bloomingdale store. And even when you go into the store, sometimes they only have certain ones in stock in the store. And sometimes online, they only have certain ones in stock online. So they're still kind of hard to get a hold of if you order and they're in stock and you get a hold of one, you're pretty lucky. So I love these bags right here next up as far as jelly bags are concerned I had to go ahead these are two of my only Amazon bags that I have and I love them they kind of remind me of the naked Chanel bag and I love these when I was on my Chanel kick with the Chanel flaps of course I didn't get a naked a Chanel naked bag is pretty expensive and to find one is hard to find even if you go on fashion file so they're pretty hard to get a hold of. And these are the next best thing, in my opinion. These little Amazon bags are the next, next best thing to the Chanel Naked bag. I just think they're so, so beautiful. I mean, 
I'm not trying to be funny. I love Amazon. I'm, my whole life is Amazon. Every five minutes, the Amazon truck is delivering to my house. But as far as some of the handbags on Amazon, I don't order them all the time. But these two, I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist the black and the gold in this lovely handbag. The clear PVC handbags by Amazon. Next, I wanted to talk about my newest baby right here, my Jelly Tabby by Coach. I had to go ahead and catch and pick up one of the Coach Jelly Tabbies. I love this. I love adding this to my PVC Jelly uh, handbag collection. So I have the Coach Jelly Tabby in the color blue. And they did this baby in a lilac purple color. They did it in a pink color. They did it in a smoky black color that looks granite. It's like a smoky gray. It's a black color, but it looks kind of smoky gray at some points in the bag. All the colors were beautiful. And I just felt so lucky to pick up this electric blue. When I tell you when the sun hit this bag, it looks like blue licorice. When the sun hits this bag and I'm wearing it, it looks like I'm wearing blue candy licorice, you guys. It just looks so, so pretty. I absolutely love it and it can hold a lot of things. There are also a few other PVC bags that I picked up from Akira. I did a giveaway a while back on my channel and I'll put a picture right here, but I have tons of the Akira handbags in neon yellow, neon pink, neon orange, I gave them away as a giveaway on my channel. I still do have a couple of them though. When I go ahead and pull, when I find the Tory Burch, Ella, and the Kira bags, I'm gonna go ahead and pull those out and then I'll come back and do a video on those. In the meantime, these are some of my jelly babies right here. I hope you girls enjoyed my video on all of my jelly PVC handbags. Remember to like, comment, subscribe on my channel. Stick with me for more fun videos. I love you guys. This was so much fun. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.